Angelina Jolie wears a wintry white dress as she takes her children to watch Star Wars, The Last Jedi in snowy New York City. She's a movie star and an ambassador, but most importantly, a mom. And Angelina Jolie wore the latter hat Saturday in snowy New York City, as she brought four of her six children, Zahora, 12, Shiloh, 11, and twins Knox and Vivian, 9, to a screening of Star Wars, The Last Jedi in Manhattan. Her teenage sons with ex Brad Pitt, Maddox, 16, and Pax, 13, were not along for the trip to the cinema. The 42-year-old actress director lived up to her fashionista image, donning a wintry ensemble of a textured wrap dress with a tan belt with heeled black boots. The Maleficent beauty accessorized with black sunglasses with a black leather handbag with metallic buttons. She was impeccably made up with her dark brown locks slightly parted to the left as she walked with her quartet of kids, who were bundled up amid the frosty conditions. Zahora kept warm in an ash gray zip-up sweatshirt with moss green cargo pants and black Nike trainers, with her hair pulled back. Shiloh matched her sister, as she also wore an ash gray zip-up over a white top with brown khaki cargo pants and black sneakers, seemingly drawing the hoodie over her face as photographers approached. Knox smiled in a padded blue zip-up vest over a blue sweatshirt with brown khaki cargo pants and black boots, while his twin sister Vivian wore a seaweed green hooded sweatshirt with patterns with camouflage pants and blue sneakers. The family seemed to be in a great mood as they made their way through the city. They were coming off a big night in the Big Apple Friday, where they visited Cipriani Wall Street for the 2017 United Nations Correspondents Association Awards where Angelina accepted the honors for 2017 UNCA Global Citizen of the Year. The Academy Award-winning actress, accepting her honors, said that people have an obligation to envision themselves in the struggles of others, and fight their fight for human rights and freedom as your fight, according to people. Jolie said that she instills the lessons that guide her ambassadorship into her children. When people of any race or of any religion are being persecuted and killed we cannot do less than we are capable of doing, she told the crowd at the Swanky Gotham Eatery. This is what I want my own children to know and value and what I have learned from them. Children have an understanding and a truth. They can instinctively feel right from wrong. They are not led by strategy they are led by morality. She thanked her kids and said she was beaming with pride over who they're growing up to be and for the hope that gives me for the future. Jolie has not just contributed on an international level, but in a big way in her own industry, as she emerged two months ago to reveal that she was one of the many women producer Harvey Weinstein made unwelcome sexual advances toward, in a hotel room when she was 23, and promoting the 1998 from Calm Playing by Heart. I had a bad experience with Harvey Weinstein in my youth, and as a result, chose never to work with him again and warn others than they did she told the New York Times. This behavior towards women in any field, any country is unacceptable. Weinstein has been accused by a total of 84 women of sexual harassment, misconduct and abuse. His rate has said that any allegations of non-consensual sex are unequivocally denied by the producer.